Leo, welcome to Fantasy Lighthouse. We're going to be taking a look at what it is that you need to know. To book a private session, all of that info can be found in the description box of this video. Okay, Leo, let's see. Spirit, please provide me with messages for Leo. All right, so we have Pisces energy coming out here right away with the Ten of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. So it's like you're looking at the bigger picture. It's like you want more. You've been thinking about whatever this is. And so you're willing to put the effort to make this grow. All right, there's something that you want to invest more in. I don't know if that's property. Okay, that's what's coming first to mind. So again, there could be something that you want to relocate to. Tell me more. Talk to me about the Ten of Pentacles energy when it comes to Leo here. The death card. All right, so there could be this energy of knowing something needs to transform in the dynamic between you and someone else or a situation around you. I feel like you've been thinking a lot about how something may seem to not be working out. And so why do you continue, right? And so therefore you are looking for other avenues. You are opening your mind and your awareness to what else is out there, okay? Because something is possible. There could be also a career that's ending for you. You want something else or something else needs to happen here is what I'm getting. Okay, tell me more. Talk to me about the death card for Leo. The Nine of Pentacles energy could definitely have something to do with money. And for others of you, I feel like you desire to be single, to be left alone, to really be on your own in order to identify what it is that you really do want. Okay, I feel that you're choosing to be independent, to go your own way, regardless of what this group of people has to say. There's a group of people that have their opinions, but I feel like right now you're being called to not pay attention to this group, whomever they are. Tell me more. King of Pentacles, Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We have Taurus and Libra here. You're looking to expand elsewhere. So you could be losing interest in some people here or someone, there's something you're losing interest in. And you've been thinking about how you're going to make this next move or something like that. It's like you're waiting. This is a period of waiting and being very analytical of what's taking place around you so that you know which direction to take. The star, you're looking for that new beginning. It's like you're hoping for it. Um, you could be planning on it. There's a lot of planning type of energy here, a lot of concentration. I feel you very um, focused on how you see your future in the next five years. Talk to me about love. The Knight of Cups. All right, so you have an interest here in someone. Talk to me about the Knight of Cups energy when it comes to Leo. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn energy. Some of you guys could be dealing with an earth sign. Doesn't have to be. Or there's a Cancer, a Scorpio, Pisces energy here. I feel like you are taking the initiative to reach out to someone or to make something happen for yourself in terms to being fulfilled when it comes to love. Talk to me about the Page of Pentacles. Talk to me about this energy. Hmm. So there could be a fire sign here that's watching over this whole situation, all right? Aries, Leo, Sagittarius. This person is very attentive. Even if they're not a fire sign, I just feel like Someone is really paying attention to the person that you're interested in or the person that you're collaborating with for some reason, okay? There's this energy of watching, being vigilant of what Leo is up to or what Leo's person of interest is up to. Hmm. Tell me more about the Page of Swords energy. Tell me more about the Page of Swords. The Hierophant, Taurus. It's like somebody that wants more 
from someone that you're interested in. There's someone else in the background, Leo. It's like if you're interested in somebody, then they have another option or somebody that's waiting on them is what I get. Tell me more. This person is like, they feel like they're losing the person that you're interested in. Okay, they could feel that because obviously that individual could be connecting with you. Even if you're not physically speaking to this person spiritually, you could have like this energetic tie to this individual. Tell me more. The Emperor, Aries. Talk to me about the Emperor coming out here. <laughs> yeah, somebody doesn't trust this situation Somebody does not like the fact that somebody is being so cold right now or, yeah, you could, you could be dealing with somebody who's very judgmental. I feel like this is also behind the person that you are interested in. It's like, this person that they deal with or dealt with, or I don't even know if they deal with this person. This person is probably mad just because they can't get your person of interest's attention. It's like they can't get their attention. So, um, yeah, this seems very stubborn. It's like somebody's jealous. They want what you have type of energy. Yeah, somebody wants what you have. Or what you're about to get or something like that. All right. So that's what I have for you, Leo. I want to thank you for watching. To book a private session, all of that info is below. Take care.